Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell, former Jamaica Labour Party councillor Don Crary and his alleged accomplice, 22-year-old Shanique Williams, have been remanded on rape charges at least until Monday. At that time, resident magistrate Simone Wolfries will make a decision on a bail application, which was made on Friday afternoon by attorney Tom Tavares Vinson. Supporters of North East St. Elizabeth MP Raymond Price want to stop Saturday's selection exercise in the constituency, claiming his challenger is not eligible. Price, a first-time MP, is being challenged by Evan Redman for the right to represent the PNP in the upcoming general election. The state-owned Jamaica Urban Transit Company is seeking to sell 60 of its old buses to generate money for its cash-strapped coffers. The JUTC says the buses are up for sale as scrap metal. Motorists on Friday started paying more to use the Mount Rossa toll road. The toll rate for Class 1 vehicles is now $360 up from $200, Class 2 $715 up from $295, and Class 3 $1,075 up from $1,000. In sports, World Championship silver medalist Elaine Thompson held on for third place in the Diamond League 200 meters on Friday. World champion Daphne Shippers continued her dominance while American Allison Felix ended second. In your weather forecast, Saturday morning will be partly cloudy. In the afternoon, there will be scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms, mainly across hilly inland areas. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.